The children of late Mr. Ebe Omoruyi offer thanks to God for the successful funeral ceremony of their patriarch and chairman managing director of Iyare Group of Companies, Mr. Ebe Omoruyi. Indigents of Igbaland and invited guests also joined the family of the late business icon to give thanks to God. Bishop Goodluck Imaswe prayed for God's special grace for the children to be united and continue in their father's legacies. The son of the deceased, Mr. Saitin Ebe, on behalf of the family, expressed gratitude to all for standing by them throughout the funeral of their father, late Mr. Ebe Omori. God in heaven, I pray and my wish is that my siblings and I remain united. Amen. Earlier in his message, Dr. Samsi Usagi urged the children and the entire Egba indigenous to stay united and keep the good legacies of late Mr. Ebe Omori. He became fathers to so many fatherless. He became a mother to many motherless. He became a helper to those who were helpless. He defended those who were defenseless. Some Egba indigents and guests, including the wives of late Mr. Ebe Omoriyi, appreciated God that their husband lived a fulfilled life. Uh, Yare was our grand patron. He has always been a leader, a motivator. All the days of the program, there was no rain. Clear indication that Yare, Mr. Ebe Omoriyi, was a good man. He's a man of peace. He's a man of the people. He's a father. He represents so much to the community. My husband, Mr. Ebe Amoruyi, a man with a golden heart. He was a good man, kind. Guests were thereafter entertained at the deceased residence alongside a table tennis tournament final, the favorite sport of Mr. Ebe Amoruyi, to wrap up the funeral ceremony. How good and fulfilling for you to give your loved one a befitting funeral. That is the case for the children of the late CEO, a Yare group of companies, Mr. Ebe Omori, who just laid their father to rest. The five days funeral activities have been so eventful, and the memory will linger on in the minds of many globally. From Egba Lands, Rosalind Evorame, ITV News.